Mind telling us where you were that night? I was where most people are, in bed. Anyone corroborate that? I should be so lucky. Come on, lads, this is ridiculous. I don't know what you're playing at, but I didn't do this. I didn't kill anyone. And you can't have a single piece of evidence that says otherwise. Can we hurry this up? I've got a very sick daughter at home. Your daughter's being looked after. No, you don't understand. She needs constant medical attention. Well, presumably, she's well enough to travel long distance. We understand you're headed for New York tomorrow. Yeah, well, like I said, she's been very ill. I'm taking her on holiday. How long for? You see, we check with the airlines. There's no return flight booked. Was there a reason you might not want to travel back here, Mr Wicks? It's still a free country, isn't it? I mean, none of this is evidence. You lot are reaching because you've got nothing. <laughs> what? That's something interesting at your flat. For the tape, DC Wisson is showing Mr. Wicks a meat thermometer. Is it yours? No. Well, it was found at your property. I think I saw it earlier, but it's not mine. It's probably there when I moved in. What's the big deal about a meat thermometer, anyway? Fits the profile of the weapon used to kill Keanu Taylor. We've been looking for that weapon, and once the labs have finished their tests, we know if we've found it. You can't seriously think that I killed that Keanu bloke. So, we've got a weapon that matches the profile of the murder weapon. Found in your kitchen. It's probably in loads of kitchens. As I said, see what the lab says, eh? We also know that his dead body was wrapped in a tarpaulin that came from your place of work. That was stolen from outside the shop, you know that. And that you'd made hastily arranged plans to abscond. Which I explained. Well, I'm sure you could make a good stab at explaining away everything anyway, Mr Wicks. <laughs> Around midnight, Christmas Day, your sister-in-law, Linda Carter, saw you dragging a heavy item wrapped in tarpaulin into the Bridge Street Cafe. No, no, no. This is Linda. She's lying to you. She's setting me up because she hates me. Sit down, Mr Wick. Can't you see she is lying to you? I'm being framed. She's had 